These seven local residents were honored at this year's Huntsville Sports Hall of Fame ceremony. Not only were there four new names inducted into the Hall of Fame on Saturday night, residents also celebrated this year's recipients of the Jan Glenn and Mike Greaves Awards. For the countless hours of dedication and hard work that I did to uh, keep the 70.3 here, build up the, uh, the, the knowledge of uh, Huntsville and the triathlon world, like literally around the world, as being a premier place to, to do the sport of triathlon and endurance sport in general. It's just, it's a great recognition for all the, the time and effort and, and the sacrifice. The funny thing is, looking around the room tonight, I recognize a lot of people that I've worked with, and it's just the wonderful feeling of being in a room like this, that, you know, the like-mindedness of so many people in this community. It's kind of like everyone's winning the award, quite honestly, because we always all work together, and if it's not this committee, it's another committee, and if it's not today, it'll be tomorrow, and we, it's such a great community for just, it's easy to come out and do stuff like this. It was a huge recognition. It was a wonderful email to receive because when you volunteer you don't do it for recognition but when it comes it sure is feels great um, great group of people that we worked with with under 18 I couldn't have had a better partner in crime with Janet it was we were in charge of fun and we sure had a lot of fun it is quite an honor it's uh it's making me reflect on the things that our community is all about and it's uh, we've got so many great role models and mentors in this community and it just uh, it's inspiring to see to be one of those people that have been now uh, given this opportunity to be inducted to the Huntsville, Huntsville Sports Hall of Fame. Well it's, it's a great thing for, for Huntsville in general for, for the kids of Huntsville no matter what sport they're getting involved in. For me my passion was soccer so I wanted to do more for soccer and get a place for kids to grow up playing soccer because that's what I love. Did I know it was going to go the last 20 years? No, but it doesn't matter. It was it was what I wanted to do and I think the, it's a good thing for the for the kids of Huntsville. It's phenomenal. It's a, it's a town, it's a community that is so vibrant and when, when I think that we have Olympic athletes, we have a gold medal winner and you know when you get involved in the soccer club as a community program you never think that you're part of a community that can aspire to an Olympic gold. It's incredible. It's really amazing. Um, I do know that he feels very honored about it, um, very thrilled. He loves his community, loves playing sports, so he's very happy. I, I love growing up in Huntsville. Uh, everybody looks out for each other. I think I mentioned about my dad seeming to know everyone because of sports, and it gives a real community feel. I, I guess I ended up knowing a lot of people because my dad knew a lot of people and it's, I mean, it stemmed from sports maybe? I'm not sure. I, I wasn't here when he was mostly involved in, in the things he's being honoured for but uh, it's just a great, it's just a great community to be involved with. Once again a big round of applause for all the inductees this evening.